Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel The Informant. If someone is new to this channel, let me just remind you that we make videos related to online services, placement drives, education and many more. In this video, we will be sharing an important information about Cognizant SME interview experience and it is my own SME interview experience. I will be telling each and every details from starting to ending what I have faced in the interview. So watch the video without skipping and stay tuned till the end so that you don't miss any important information regarding this video. So let us start our video. So before sharing my interview experience, I want to clarify some doubts. We were repeatedly getting comments from past few days that when we will get to know that uh, we have SME interview. So after completion of your internship, start preparing for your interview because you, you may get it any time after your project completion. Uh, like after uh, two to three days you may get so in my case I got a uh, interview mail on Monday at night 11 51 p.m. that I have interview at, uh, I have interviewed tomorrow so you may get at any time they will tell within two days within three days within one week no some people will get a interview mail two days before some people will get uh, 24 hours before but some people will get uh, uh, five hours six hours before also so be uh, so be prepared for this interview and after completion your internship try to start preparing for this interview and uh, many uh, people have doubted uh, in the same day uh, we can have uh, both a mock interview or a mo mock interview and sm interview yeah uh, on same day you might have a mock interview also sm interview also both are same only so you have to attend both if you have mock interview don't think that you will not have sm interview definitely you have sm interview also mock interview also and uh, many people have doubt that uh, when we will get results so before they were sending result uh, uh, if you complete today they will be sending tomorrow no now this time they have changed everything what they are doing uh, first uh, they are planning inter uh, sm interview for full one cohort if when they complete full cohort interview then after completion of all the students interview then they will then they are giving results so you, you can get uh, you can uh, expect your results in two days also three days also till your cohort members interview get completed you will not get results so definitely you will get results uh, after completion of your uh, uh, cohort members so let us start uh, some uh, some questions which I have got and I will be sharing the questions which I have got also and uh, my cohort members also got so uh, watch the video without skipping so the questions were uh, what is STLC he asked me to explain uh, what is uh, STLC also and he asked me to explain all the phases so full detail explanation he asked about STLC you might get SDLC software development life cycle so be ready for everything so difference between UI and API testing if you tell one difference that is also more than enough mention the types of navigations commands so uh, you have to tell all the types of navigation commands uh, how to type text in an input box using selenium uh, how to scroll down a page so this and all they will ask you to write a syntax in chat box uh, what are the selenium suite components so sometimes they will ask you to just mention the suite components sometimes they will ask you to explain one of the suite component like selenium grid selenium ide selenium remote control like that so be prepared for everything don't just uh, 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 read the headings be prepared what is that also what is the difference between selenium 2.0 and selenium 3.0 what is agile process uh, and see uh, many people have got uh, program also many uh, starting they were not asking any program now they are asking program also so don't think that you will not get a program you will get only theoretical questions no you have to prepare some basic programs also they are asking uh, uh, that programs also and personally I also got a program what is test automation or automation testing test case template they are they told me to uh, tell the uh, uh, steps what you uh, what you will write in test case template mention the types of web locators all web locators uh, what are the uh, testing types supported by selenium like functional testing regression testing smoke testing sanity testing some people got uh, uh, what is the difference between sanity uh, testing and uh, smoke testing also so they are asking anything what is selenis how it is classified so you have to explain what is selenis and uh, uh, its uh, classification actions uh, assertions accesses like that what are the advantages of uh, automation testing one two advantage if you tell it's more than enough list out the names of programming languages browsers and operating system that are supported by selenium uh, what are the testing mm, types supported by selenium how to assert the title of a web page so two steps if you tell it's enough 
how to click on a hyperlink in selenium this and all you can answer in one word also no problem uh, see again program to compare to list and print the duplicate what are the types of weights supported by web driver so this is the most important question many students almost all students are getting this question they will tell uh, you to explain the weights also like implicit weight explicit weight fluent weight what is the major difference between driver close and driver quit this is also important what do you mean by xpath uh, explain uh, uh, absolute xpath and uh, attributes xpath this is also important question what is the difference between uh, single slash and double slash in xpath what are the different types of annotations which are used in selenium this is also very very important questions question what is the difference between find element and find elements so this page is very very important you might uh, get uh, almost uh, four to five questions definitely what are the types of weights supported by web driver see so many people repeatedly have got uh, types of weights types of testing what is selenium difference between verification and validation this is also this and all you can answer in one word list out some of the automation tools which could be integrated with selenium to achieve continuous testing uh, so you can list uh, three to four that is also enough what is the major difference between driver close and driver quit see again it came so many people are getting what is the difference between driver close and driver quit types of locators types of commands uh, method overleading and method overriding this also many people are getting program selenium program to give input in login page and submit so uh, what uh, they are not asking to write the full selenium program to give input in login page they are asking some syntax like how you can submit the login page how you can log in the how you will give input to the login page like that they will not ask the full program to write they will ask some uh, middle thing syntax they will ask syntax they will concentrate Mention the types of web locators again. Same. Mention the types of navigations command again. Navigation command here. So this and all some important questions uh, uh, which students uh, re recently got. So if you have any doubt, drop down in the comment box so that you, uh, we can clear your uh, doubt. And uh, see, interview will be easy only if you prepare well and uh, try to concentrate more on uh, project so they will ask you on main main thing they are asking project only you have to explain what and all you did especially the main project so what and all logic you have applied what and all uh, you did everything they are asking proper uh, uh, everything they are asking on uh, that only so concentrate more on main project and uh, 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 some people some interviewer are asking just practical thing they are not asking any uh, uh, theoretical thing what they are asking the like the, they are asking to write a code they are asking to write a syntax they are not asking any uh, theoretical question uh, one of my co cohort member got just practical questions he asked uh, to write uh, the syntax of printing the screen uh, he has to told to write the uh, syntax of uh, input page and uh, sql database so it, it will be depend upon interviewer so almost 90% of students are getting uh, theoretical questions only but be prepared for theoretical also practical also so interview will be easy only if you prepared well so concentrate more on the important questions what uh, students are getting and uh, you can take the screenshots also if you want and if you have any doubt you can drop down in the comment box and if you want answers also uh, we, uh, we will give the answers so you can uh, comment in our YouTube and you can contact through our uh, uh, telegram so we will be sending answers there so don't worry we, we, we will help you be prepared for your, your interview so this is all about our today's video thank you for watching our video if you feel our content informative please do like subscribe share and stay tuned